What's going on everybody? Welcome back to DevSips. In this video, we're going to be breaking down something that is going to be very beneficial, especially for those new into programming looking to make money fast. That's right. I said being able to make money fast. So the reality is in programming, you can make money within two to four months in software engineering. Now that sounds very promising, but I want you to listen very carefully because I don't want you to follow through this video thinking that you're gonna be able to land a job quickly or things along those lines. So at DevSlips Academy, that's our mentorship program where we teach hundreds of students to learn how to code. We have them follow a set path and that path is through web development. But here's the thing, once our students reach the JavaScript section of our curriculum, meaning they've mastered HTML and CSS and they're dabbling in JavaScript, we start opening up and teaching them how to go out and get freelance projects. Now, this is an awesome way to make money as a programmer. In fact, some of our students, as they land their freelance projects, they use it to pay for the program. It's part of our earn while you learn curriculum. But these freelance projects, if you go and look on Upwork, you can easily find 250, 300 to $500 projects that are relatively simple to build. People asking for their websites to be updated or basic HTML and CSS work. Sometimes these people need help with automation. And these are tasks that developers who are in HTML and CSS and dabbling in JavaScript can easily take on. Now, not only is this beneficial to you because, you know, who doesn't like making 300 bucks, but it's also beneficial to your future in programming. That's right, as you go out and land freelance projects, you can then put them on your portfolio to help leverage you into a high paying job. By having a portfolio of paid work, it really helps you stand out from the crowd. Now, going back to what I said earlier, these freelance projects do not need to be anything crazy. We're not asking you to go out and land a $500 monthly retainer project or a $1,500 monthly retainer project or anything along those lines. We do not want getting freelance projects to be as difficult as it is to get a job. That's why these freelance projects, you have to start small. If we were to look on Upwork right here and we can see some of these projects, landing page builder, WordPress rockstar, WordPress website fix, these projects are gonna be relatively easy to accomplish. And what we're looking for is we're looking for fixed price projects. For example, if we take a look at this project right here, it's called JavaScript drop-down list. As a fixed price about $100, this is an easy project we can take on and tackle. Need someone proficient in JavaScript to create a multi-step drop-down list like one on the homepage of partsgeek.com. These people have things kind of vague, but we can easily get on here and see what they're doing. And a lot of these projects are relatively simple to accomplish, but there's something that you can take and put on your portfolio and showcase as actual work that you've been paid to do. And not only that, is you can easily make money. And this is what makes programming so much more fun and so much more enticing rather than other career paths out there. Because programming gives you the opportunity to make money early on, even if you just know basic things. For example, we have some students in the program who will apply for these projects, go into the academy and be like, hey, I don't really know how to do all of this. Can someone help me with this? And they still will end up solving the project. That's the beauty of programming and that's the beauty of freelancing with software engineering. So like I said, this video is going to be pretty short and it's going to get straight to the point but the idea here is this you can make money early on in programming now that don't mean that you're going to go out and land a job pretty quick in two to three months but within three to four months of programming if you're following a set path if you're getting help and the mentorship you need you can easily transition into becoming a freelancer and helping people solve their problems and helping yourself make a little bit extra cash in your pocket. That can either go to whatever program you're paying for, like some of our students do, they use their money to pay for the DevSlips Academy, or it can just go to paying the bills. But the idea is, is you can truly earn while you're learning how to code. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. If you love this, hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you guys in the next video.